Hello and welcome to how to add blueprint shortcuts. So you may be familiar with some shortcuts already available to you in blueprints. Most commonly we use to hold down the B key and left click, create a branch. There's others as well such as G and F plus some others too. But what about if you want to add your own one? Now commonly we often use our, uh, are using print string. And let's say I want to change P and left click to spoil a print string node. At the moment, P and left click creates a begin play event, which I find is pretty useless. We only going to call that once. So let's change that to do a print string. So how do we do this? And how do we actually add more shortcuts to this? Well, for these type of shortcuts, you have to go into the config files. The config files are like so. You'll find them inside the UE4 install. So I'm in UE underscore 426. So find that wherever you've installed it onto your PC. Most commonly, it'll be on your C drive in your program folder. You want to head to engine, into config folder, and then scroll down until you find base editor per project user settings. Open this up. And this will open up in notepad or wordpad, whichever one you use. And in here, we're going to control F to search for blueprint. And keep going until you find blueprint spawn nodes section here. And these are the definitions for each of those shortcuts. As you can see here, receive begin play. This is the key you need and however modifiers you may want. You've got others as well like do n, delay, and so on and so forth. And you can add whatever ones you want to this list. So for example, I'm going to change my receive begin play to be a print string instead. So all I'm going to do is change the class here to the class of my print string, which is just print string. Really simple. I'm going to leave P alone. And leave the rest of it alone too and it's important if i want to add more to this i can just add more lines to this i can just copy a line change what class it is if you don't know what the class is called exactly you can find it in documentation on ue4 website and you can change what key and any modifiers it may need so with that done we're going to file and save that close that and then we need to close our editor and reopen it so let's go do that now we've restarted our editor we go back into our blueprint and now if i hit hold down p and hit left click i'll spawn a print string node much better much easier and a lot quicker in getting those print strings in there thanks for watching hopefully you enjoyed this how to if you want to see more how to's and more videos from me head over to patreon.com forward slash ryan daily where a donation of just one dollar a month will get access to all my videos months before anyone else Thank you to all my patrons and thank you for subscribing. I'll see you all next time. Bye everyone.